Founded in the year 1936, Brahma Kumaris has activities in more than 110 countries across the globe. With its headquarters located in Mount Abu, Rajasthan, India, the Brahma Kumaris World Spiritual University is a socio-spiritual, non-governmental organization, NGO, with affiliations in many UN bodies. It started with affiliations in the year 1980 with the UNDPI, United Nations Department of Public Information, followed by affiliation from ECOSOC, observer status in UNFCCC, UNCBD, UNEP, and recently in UNCCD. COP and COIS Brahma Kumari's delegates participate actively in these events for providing spiritual dimensions to decision-making, action planning, and helping to obtain a more holistic approach. Brahma Kumari's is also an active member of Green Interfaith Dialogues. In 2011, Brahma Kumaris and World Renewable Spiritual Trust were recognized by the Ministry of Science and Technology as a scientific and industrial research organization. India One Solar Thermal Power Plant is one of India's largest solar projects with a capacity of 1 megawatt. It is functional since 2017. On an institutional level, Brahma Kumaris are the largest users of solar energy in India. It also stands to be one of the oldest organizations to work with solar energy in the country. The journey with solar energy started long back in 1996 with the installation of modular solar cooking systems. Soon, more research led to the use of solar energy in various activities like water heating, cooking more than 40,000 meals a day, using solar in almost all day-to-day -day activities. 350 solar photovoltaic battery systems of a total capacity of 1.4 megawatt peak were installed in different branches of the organization. The Ministry of New and Renewable Energy Government of India and United Nations Development Programme sponsored an awareness and training center on solar energy in Shantivan campus in 2014. The Brahma Kumaris have shared its best practices with other organizations to equip them with solar power. Sustainable Yogic Agriculture is an ongoing research program in which traditional organic farming with interventions of Raja Yoga meditation is being studied by many agricultural universities in the country. It has been recognized by the Government of India. Tapo 1 a 100-acre dedicated farming land is being used for the research to help farmers deal with growing agricultural issues. For more than 10 years, we have taken care of nearly 20 parks in Mumbai. Our very own Peace Park in Mount Abu is home to thousands of varieties of flowering plants. Our lifestyle, discipline of vegetarianism is also a way of decreasing our carbon footprint. The Brahma Kumari's Gyan Sarovar Academy for a Better World was presented to Habitat 2, the second United Nations Conference on Human Settlements held in Istanbul, Turkey. It was recognized as part of the Best Practice Initiative for Human Settlements. Our vision is for individuals, governments, and global corporations involved in the environmental decision-making process to root their work in the universal spiritual principles and thus bring harmony, clarity, calmness, stability and power to their thinking and interactions. It is the aim of the Brahma Kumaris to highlight the relationship between our awareness and the technology we choose. We believe that a holistic approach based on peace, cooperation and love is the key to a sustainable future.